a square piece of tin a square piece of tin of side 24 cm of side 24 cm is to be made into a box without top is to be made into a box without top by cutting a square from each corner by cutting a square from each corner and folding up the flaps and folding up the flaps to form a box to form a box what should be the side of the square to be cut off so that the volume of box is maximum so that the volume of the box is maximum also find out what is the volume of that box one square box sorry square sheet of tin dimension of that will be 24 centimeter by 24 centimeter from this sheet four corners square corners we cut this is one square this is second square third and fourth each will be of equal dimension are cut and removed so when you remove this you will be having this type of shape this type of shape and then we have to fold it this way this you fold this you fold and this you fold when you fold it it will become a square uh, sorry cuboid with the open top top will not be there its open box will be there so we will say it will be forming a box open box and we want the dimension of this box so that the volume come out to be maximum in that actually we should find out what is the x here what is the uh, square dimension we should have that uh, we should cut it from four corner that the volume come out to be max so to get that what we do let the x is the side of each square we cut when you cut this then uh, when you do the folding this will be the base yeah, the first fold, the second, the third, the fourth. The length of the x, right? This is also x. So height of this will be x, and this base will be what? This total is twenty-four. Is this a x? So yeah, a x. So yeah, so yeah, twenty-four minus two x. It means when you are constructing a box. Then this base will be 24 minus 2x, this will be 24 minus 2x, and this come out to be simply x. So the volume of the box will be 24 minus 2x into 24 minus 2x into x. This is the volume, and we want this volume is to be maximum. So now coming on the question, volume we calculate. Volume is what? It will be 24 minus 2x whole square into x. This is the volume we have of this open box. And we want that this volume should be maximum. When volume is maximum, we should find out what is the dimension we have of this uh, square which you cut from each corner. 
So how we do it? Just check. Now we differentiate it first. dv by dx. What the derivative comes? 24 minus 2x whole square into x cauda 1 and second time 2 times 24 minus 2x into minus 2 and x remain as it is. There and now this should be equated to 0. Uh, first thing which we can do here common is 24 minus 2x which is common here. Left is 24 minus 2x and minus of 4x and that come out to be 0 to get the possible point of local maxima or minimum. Then I'll write this is 24 minus 2x and this will be 24 minus 6x coming 0. Then we get x is coming 12 and here it is x is coming 4. X is coming 12 and X is coming 4. So if X is 12, one thing is clear, X 12 is not possible. Why it is not possible? Just check here. This was the square sheet. Here, these are the four corners you have cut. And if I take this as 12 and this as 12, then this portion is not left. The total is 24 and if you cut 4 square, you have cut 12, 12, then you have no metal. It means we will say volume come out to be minimum, so this is not possible, so x cannot be taken 12. Now we will try that at x is equal to 4, it is coming minimum or maximum. So we go for the derivative of it. So we go for second derivative. So we go for b to b by dx square. When you do the derivative of this, it come out to be minus 2 into 24 minus 6x plus 24 minus 2x into minus of 6. Okay, and that we calculate the second derivative d2v by dx square, where x comes out to be 4. When x is 4, this part is clearly 0. This will come 4 to the 8. 8 and this is 24. So it will come 24 minus 8 into minus 6, which is negative value. And if it is negative, what I should say? Yes, the volume come out to be maximum when x is coming 4. And if x is 4, volume is maximum, they are asking what is the volume also? You calculate. So we calculate volume maximum. Come out to be 24 minus 2x. 2x means 2 into 4. This is 8 whole square and then it will be x is coming 4. Then this will come 16 square into 4. Then your answer will come out to be 1024 centimeter is the volume of this box which is maximum. Next question, please. A window is in the form of semicircle. A window is in the form of semicircle with a rectangle on its diameter. With a rectangle on its diameter. Given the parameter of the figure, given the parameter of the figure, find the dimension in order that area come out to be maximum. Find the dimension in that in uh, order that the area of this window is maximum or we can say the maximum light enter it. It's a semicircular window. 
this is semicircle we have and on its diameter we have our rectangle so this is the shape of window we have and parameter of this window is given so let the parameter is given p and now we want that dimension of this window you should tell that its area is maximum or we say maximum light can enter in it so if uh, we have parameter with us one thing it's a semi circular part so let the radius of this is r so this will be 2r now diameter of it this is also coming to r this will be x this will be x and this circular part will be pi r the length of this circular part is pi r question says parameter is known parameter agar malum hai to kya hoga 1 2 3 and the 4 This way the parameter is known. Please don't take this 2r as the parameter. It is not in the parameter. So what we have parameter, it will be 2r plus x plus pi r plus of x. So I got the parameter as 2r plus 2x plus pi r. This is the parameter which is given in the question. If the parameter is known now, we want the area of this to be maximum. So, if you want the area to be maximum, what this will be? This is x into two r plus the area of this circular part that is pi r squared by two. Area of this part is pi r squared by two. This will be two r into x. So, this is area plus this area that will be the area of the total window. And now what we want this should be x. X हम को calculate करना है क्योंकि यहाँ single variable में convert करना पड़ेगा because two r r is the radius not known to us. X is also not known to us. So two variables are there. We'll convert them into a single variable. To get the single variable, I'll calculate the value of x better because that to be placed only once. So what I do here, x I calculate from here. So I get it p minus two r. Minus pi r come out to be two x, or uh, we can get the value of two x directly. We we'll put it area is r remain as it is. Two x value is this p minus two r minus pi r plus pi r squared by two, or I should say area is p into r. Minus two r square minus pi r square plus pi r square by two. This is minus pi r square. This is plus pi r square by two. So area comes out to be what? That will be p into r minus two r square minus pi r square by two. This is the area we got of this window. After getting this area, we calculate whether it is uh, where it is having maximum area or not. So we go for d a by d r. This will come out to be only p constant minus of 4r, and this is come out to be minus 2 pi r by 2, and should be equated to zero. And this two get cancel out. Then I write down p minus 4r minus pi r comes out to be zero. Or I should say p minus 4 plus pi into r is coming to zero. Or what should be r in this case? P by 4 plus pi. This is the radius we have. Radius is coming by as p by 4 plus pi. After getting this radius, now we check whether it is maximum or minimum. So we go for second derivative. That is d two a by d r square. 
what that will come p will be 0 minus 4 will be here 4r and left is minus 5 and this will check at egg r is equal to p by 4 plus 5 and definitely this quantity come out to be negative And if this come out to be negative, what I should say, yes, the parameter area of this uh, window is maximum. And uh, what is the dimension if they ask? If they ask the dimension, then one thing is clear, radius is known. Then what is the length and breadth of this window? This was the window. This radius already we have calculated that is p by 4 plus 5. Now its length of the rectangle will be what? 2r. This length was 2r. So 2r also you can calculate that will come to p by 4 plus 5. And then we calculate the x. x aapka yahan se kya jayega? p minus 2r minus pi r by 2. And this also you can calculate P minus 2R. 2R ki value at 2P by 4 plus pi minus pi into R. R aapka aega P by 4 plus pi. 4 divided by 2. And now when you solve this result, what this will come? 4 plus pi is the LCM here. So it will come 4p plus p pi minus of 2p minus of p pi whole by 2. This is p pi gone, left is 2p upon 2 times 4 plus pi. This 2 also cancel out, this will be coming your x. So x is also coming p by 4 plus pi. So it will be p by 4 plus pi. This will be 2p by 4 plus pi. And the radius is already p by 4 plus pi. So this way you will be having the window which will have the maximum p. Next question.